Well, hello there, and good evening, everyone. I'm having to use my old uh, camera tonight because the other one I had uh, just didn't want to work. So I've had to ignore the other uh, video, so I'm making another one with the old uh, camera. And I'm going to try to rush it a little bit since I'm running kind of a little late, and my rushing will end up being who knows how long. <laughs> I'm uh, William Brantley from the University Village Apartments on Walker Road in the North Jackson, Tennessee area, ready to share with you uh, today's climate summary, yesterday's, and a, in a brief forecast uh, as I go along. Uh, yesterday's high temperature was, uh, what was it, uh, 64 degrees, yesterday's uh, low was 34 degrees. And I had no rainfall here in uh, North Jackson yesterday. Uh, the highest wind gust was uh, 12 miles per hour out of the east at 9.46 a.m. Today's climate summary, as of 5 p.m., the skies were clear at 5 p.m. And the temperature was 56 degrees. The dew point was 32 degrees. The humidity was at 41%. The wind was calm and the barometric pressure was 30.13 inches of mercury. Uh, today's low temperature was 41 degrees. Today's high was 69 degrees. And uh, no rainfall fell today. Actually, 69 was a very pleasant high. Uh, Sunday, we had sunny skies today. Uh, a little cool in the morning, but warmed up very nicely. Had a beautiful day here in Jackson and West Tennessee with a high of 69 degrees. The lowest uh, dew point, excuse me, the lowest relative humidity today was 27 percent at uh, 2 p.m. and 3 p.m. while the highest was 93 percent at 2 and 4 a.m. The lowest uh, barometric pressure today was 30.13 uh, inches and that was at 2 through 5 p.m. today, while the highest would be 30.20 inches, and that, that was at 8 a.m. through 10 a.m., while the highest wind gust would be north at 9 miles per hour at about 11.35 a.m. this morning. Now, today's records for no December the 2nd would be 77 degrees, would be the hottest high in 1982, the coldest high would be 28 degrees in 1985. The warmest low would be 68 degrees in 1982, while the coldest low would be 16 degrees in 1960. And the rainfall record for today would be 2.74 inches in 1967, and there is no snowfall record. Okay, now let me uh, wash on through, I think, to the uh, other uh, things like uh, the national, uh, well, satellite picture. Now, since I have the old camel back, I'm not going to be able to flip uh, through the different ones like, this, like I did with the other camera. This one won't let me do it, so I'm going to show it to you from a national view. And actually, it's pretty decent right here in Tennessee. The skies are clear. This is the radar. And as you can see, where it's uh, precipitating, snowing pretty heavy up there in the northwest part of uh, the United States. And otherwise, uh, there's light rain and a few spots. Otherwise, the weather is great. That's the AccuWeather's version of, uh, of the radar. All right, let's look at the satellite picture, also from AccuWeather, which really is a pretty good picture, showing the clear skies around here. Let me get a close-up view of Tennessee here. You can see there might be a few high clouds going by, but no big deal. Most cases, there's some clouds on down. There's a little bit better view right there uh, of some clouds in Texas moving in our direction. They probably won't be here until, uh, I believe, Monday uh, midday, around 3 or 4 o'clock Monday. 
Tomorrow should be a beautiful day here in uh, West Tennessee. And there you see the other clouds around the country. Words raining and word hidden and uh, so forth. All right, let me go ahead and look at the current uh, map. Uh, thanks to uh, Weather Underground, that might be big enough to just show it. Let me see if I can, uh, if I change it, that might mess up. I forgot about that. Uh, you can kind of get an idea of where everything is. Putting the camera this close, it works a little bit better. You can see where the highs and lows are. Worst precipitation, we got, we got precipitating and so on. Two high pressures taking care of us, one over Kentucky and uh, Alabama, and there you see the uh, other low pressures and warm fronts and stationary fronts and where all that is. All right, all right let me go ahead and rush on to, uh, to the uh, forecast map. Well, let me read you the forecast. Uh, turned out maybe turned out to be the shortest one I ever made. Uh, uh, actually, testing this one out. Now, tonight it's going to be uh, mostly clear, or at least fair, anyways, through Sunday, and actually through Monday morning, becoming mostly cloudy by Monday night, with an 80% chance of rain by Monday night on into Tuesday morning. Now back a little bit to tonight, uh, the moon is beautiful out there. Uh, it sets at uh, 5.19 a.m. tomorrow morning. With fair skies tomorrow, we should have a low in the morning of about 39 degrees. That'll be a little bit warmer than this morning. No, it won't. That'd be colder. It was 41 this morning, 39 tomorrow morning. Sorry about that. <laughs> it's going to be colder tomorrow morning. Tomorrow's high should get up to again about 69 degrees tomorrow. That's how we we'll made it today with uh, east winds at 10 to 20 miles per hour. And if you'd like, of course, I know you want to know, the sun rises in the morning at 6.48 a.m., sets at 4.42 p.m. tomorrow evening. And uh, the moon will be rising tomorrow evening at 5.12 uh, p.m., and setting at 6.30 a.m. Wednesday, uh, Monday morning, I'm sorry. And speaking of Monday, it's going to be fair skies till near sunset, 3 o'clock to 5 o'clock. Around in that time frame, it uh, should become uh, um, uh, mostly cloudy by then. And then uh, an 80% chance of rain from that point on, on into Monday night from around sunset to on past midnight, Monday night. With a low near 48 degrees and a high of 72 Monday, woo, gonna feel a real good Monday. With south winds at uh, 15 to 25 miles per hour. And by the way, the full moon is complete uh, Monday. And uh, it'll be rising at 6, 11 p.m. And, uh, and rising and setting weather at 7.40 a.m. Tuesday morning, the moon will be. And speaking of Tuesday, it's going to be mostly cloudy continued with a 40% chance of some rain till about noontime, but remaining mostly cloudy till about midnight and then becoming fair by Tuesday night around midnight. With a low near 46 and a high of 50 with north winds at 10 to 20 miles per hour. And on Wednesday, it's finally going to clear up again, mostly clear with low near 32 and a high of 51 with north winds at 10 to 20 miles per hour. It's also going to be fair on Thursday with low near 29 and a high of 46 with uh, no west winds at uh, 10 to 20. Uh, Friday, it's going to be uh, uh, fair skies with low near 24 and a high of 45. That's next Friday, December the 8th, with uh, west winds at 10 to 20. And I'll go ahead and give you next weekend, Saturday, uh, next Saturday, December the 9th, fair skies, low near 25, high of 48, with west winds at 10 to 20. And next Sunday the 10th, mostly clear, with low near 24, and a high of 46, with west winds at 10 to 20. 
Okay, I think I'm going to call it at that. Uh, again, uh, have a pleasant night. I hope you all uh, have sweet dreams. Hope you wake up to a beautiful Sunday. And once again, it's going to be fair skies, a low of 39 and a high of 69 tomorrow with east winds at 10 to 20 miles per hour. And 69 was today's high. Okay, I don't think I left anything out, did I? I think I gave you the highest wind gust uh, north, uh, north at 10 miles per hour today, north at 9 miles per hour weather at uh, 11.35 a.m. I can't remember if I gave it to you or not. So there it is. And I'm going to conclude it at that. Hope this recording works. And if it does, I'll try to share it around since it's not quite midnight yet. And God bless you all. Good night. And I hope to talk to you, even on the old camera if it's necessary, uh, tomorrow night. <laughs> God bless you and uh, sweet dreams.